Do you ever feel like you're ever in a situation where you veer off from certain friend groups? Or that you've more so outgrown them more so than anything? Well, recently, or actually not rather recently, but only a few weeks ago, I've had this sort of experience. I know it may seem odd to see this type of video from me, as most of the videos on my channel are with people, right? Bashington, Grizzy, you know, the classic trio of friends. In recent times, I have found myself becoming more disconnected with the group's humor, personalities, and other stuff. Do I have anything against them? No. It is just stuff that happens, and yeah, this type of stuff, is, is it's just shitty. Because it never, it just never feels satisfying for either sides, but I just outgrew them. I wouldn't really call myself a very serious person, but I wouldn't consider myself exactly rotted either. The biggest reason why I left this group, other than the fact that I didn't feel seriously connected with any of the members, was because their humor and their content was just, it just felt like I didn't fit in anymore. They started to make very rot-filled content, and if you're wondering what I mean by rot, it's like the stuff you see on YouTube Kids, or just stuff that doesn't feel like it meets my standard of quality, but yet again, I don't think anyone should follow that standard at all. I don't consider my videos quality either. But basically, I just didn't want to be a part of a group that was... They were being pretty contradictory. They... I, Bashington, the head leader of the group, said that he wanted to leave the Bone Lab community. Which I fully supported. That's fine. That's good. I did that, especially because I fucking hate the Bone Lab community. But then he moved on to Roblox. Which arguably has a worse community to begin with. Now sure, he can make content on the things he wants. That's fine. But I just didn't want to be a part of it. I have no dislikes against them, nothing. I just simply wanted to move on and do my own thing. I didn't want to lose my own YouTube identity in the process of it. This is why I have produced more solo videos than usual. And it's probably going to remain that way. The only people that I still talk to from that group is Quest Archer, Cash Money, and Zero. I don't talk to Bashington, Grizzy, or any of the other folks in that GC anymore. I genuinely mean this when I say I don't dislike them. It just, I just grew out of that group. It's as simple as that. I didn't find myself to belong. I didn't want to be a part of their content. I didn't want to be associated with that type of content. It was simple as that. Because even though my content may not be the greatest, I still do try to bring new things to the table each time. I like trying. I like being experimental. And I really don't like pandering to fucking certain communities because some of them are just a bunch of four-year-olds who are really annoying. <coughs> Bone Lab community. Now... Can I say that this is surprising? Honestly, no, not at all. Despite what many people think, I actually didn't know Bash personally at all. I literally met the dude over some YouTube comments, and we made a video two years ago on fucking Boneworks Entanglement. I'm pretty sure that's not how actual friendships start, that was just a random collaboration. Now, what do I think of the older videos that still have the group in them? Oh, I fucking love them. The Lethal Company videos, the Bone Lab videos, I will always love those videos in particular. Fusion. Just the shit we did. Because back then, it felt like that group was an actual group, and it wasn't just a bunch of just lobotomites making some really weird jokes sometimes. Because the thing is, I don't mind stupid things being funny, but at some point you reach such a level of stupidity that there isn't any fun anymore, and the funny is just based on like, random bits and i don't consider my humor great i've never said any of the shit i do is great but i like i said i just didn't feel like i was a part of it anymore because i just simply grew out of it at the end of the day that is the simplest reasons for all of this back when i made those videos i was what like 14 13 i'm now 17 and i'm fucking like i'm doing stuff now much differently a different thought process and everything I've grown up. And while I hopefully get back to that group, I don't think it'll ever happen. I would, oh man, dude, I would love to go back to that like era of my channel. Yeah, sure, those videos may have not gotten the best views, but oh my God, I 
just miss having simple fun with friends. Stuff that anyone could have a laugh at. Stuff that people could see that there were chemistry between the people. But unfortunately, that isn't a thing I can have anymore. And while yes, I do speak to Quest, Cash, and Zero, I'm likely not going to be playing with them often. If there are more people that I can find to talk to, they will likely be in newer YouTube videos. If you came specifically for to see St. Bashington, Bone Lab stuff, or whatever, just, just... Honestly, my personal advice is to unsubscribe and find someone else. I don't do Bone Lab anymore. I'm never going to touch Bone Lab ever again. I am completely done with VR communities as a whole. Yes, sure, there are VR games with good communities, but Bone Lab, I'm never touching that ever again. The next time I play a VR game and post a video about it is probably years from now. Who knows? I can't predict it, but I feel like that's the case. If you came for just Bashington, not me, then you can leave too. It's your choice. I don't imagine I'm exactly that entertaining to that type of audience anymore anyways. Though the rare few who did come to stick around with me, stick around. It's your choice. I don't mind. I'm probably still going to be uploading. I mean, you know I'm fairly inconsistent as, a, as an uploader, but I don't mind if I get like low views. I do this shit for fun. But yeah, that's just the whole situation summarized. It's very weird because now it's probably be much harder to make content because the content I did used to make used to rely around friends and a lot of goofy moments. I know a guy named Spearman and I know a lot of other people. I might try to talk to them to do videos with them, but if they don't want to do it with me, that's completely fine. I don't care. I'm just happy enough to make videos in the first place. But yeah, this is just a quick update. I just want to let everyone know how things are going and why you haven't seen videos about us and the friend group in a while. That's it. Toodles. Also, if you have a gorilla tag PFP, or you even like are part of that community, leave, please, go away. Half of the comments on the fucking man video and the other bone lab videos have gorilla tag PFPs. Why the fuck are four-year-olds a part of every community? Go away.